A shocking allegation was made by District 6 County Board Member Beverly Bell at the June 6 Justice Committee meeting. During Sheriff Matt Lane's time to speak, he said they have a shortage of female corrections officers. The jail needs a certain amount of female corrections officers for things like strip searching incarcerated females. We still have several openings and we are uh, trying to recruit female corrections officers. We are, uh, we are low in, on, on female correctional officers. Uh, which poses a problem with uh, time off or required to have them uh, for searches and things um, and for, for some housing issues. So we're going to try to start recruiting heavily in that area. Member Bell, who is the vice chair of the Justice Committee, said she was told by a source that a female corrections officer who was on the floor for less than an hour quit and said, quote, this is a racist, racist place. Sheriff Lane denied knowing anything about this. Let's watch this exchange. Does any member have any questions? Member Bell. Um, how many female officers have gone through background checks and have received their uniforms and started their first day on Am the I, job? I don't, I don't know that I have that information. I'd like to be accurate when I respond to you. Um, okay. I'm not, I don't have that breakdown in front okay. of me. What I would like from you, uh, Sheriff, is that uh, it was reported to me that you had an individual female that started the first day and she lasted less than an hour. And she was heard by the other employees saying that this is a racist, racist place. No, I don't know okay. who that female is or what you're speaking of. Well, um, I would like to reach out to the public to find out if she's out there because it is a hard job to go through background checks, to mm -hmm. get your uniform, to be issued things, and to come in and say that they could not work at this place. We've asked you to hire more people, and it doesn't look good for us to waste tax dollars like this. Ms. Bell, everyone that I know of that has left the county in short order has been asked why. That answer has not been reported back to me, okay. ever. Well, I'm hoping that I can get that information who this young lady is, okay? She's out there somewhere, and uh, it saddens me that whatever happened on her first day, she did not fulfill her shift and her obligations to serve for eight hours that she's supposed to be serving. Now, Vice Chairwoman Bell did not identify her source for this information, but as you heard, she made a public plea for this alleged female corrections officers to come forward and tell her story. More Agitation Rising coming up. Thank you so much for turning into Agitation Rising, your source for local, leftist, independent journalism in central Illinois and beyond. You can always find our articles on our blog, link in the description. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Agitation Rising is under the Strange Corners of Thought umbrella, so feel free to contribute directly to our Patreon, or donate via PayPal or Cash App. Again, links in the description. Keep agitating, keep rising, and we'll see you on the other side. Thanks.